fights are evil. Um, but I will right say, uh, if I remember correct, oh my gosh, big uppercut, drop said Tillin. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, Brian Norm. Oh my gosh, he died. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Bro. Oh Lord. Bro. Oh my. Did you look like he got shot? Oh no. Oh no. I told you I should have put Buddy on Brian Norman, but I said no, I'm not going to do it. Oh, he hit him with a little jiggle. Oh, he was disrespectful. I ain't even peeped the little jiggle that he gave him. Yeah. Yeah, I'm tired of that. It was so disrespectful. Just around oh no, nah, he just there. humped his forehead. Nah, bro. Oh no, nah. Giovanni got to see him outside. He got to see him outside. Y'all see this? Bro. Hey, he squatted and looked back. And the flex right there afterwards. My goodness. Hey, he squatted and looked at him and, and posed on him. Oh, bro. Oh, I like Brian Norman. I ain't gonna lie, I like Brian Norman. That was disrespectful as hell. I like Brian Norman, bro. Oh, no, nah, I ain't even peep that he did that. Oh, no, nah, I like Brian Norman Jr., bro. I ain't gonna lie. I like him, bro. <laughs> I like him, bro. Bro, he knocked him down. Giovanni was trying to hold on to him. He hit him with this. Twerk. Girl, I want to see you twerk. I throw a little money to twerk. Oh, he was holding on to his head. Oh, no, nah, I'm saying Tiller got to see him outside. And then he knocked him out and hit him with the... He hit him with the prison pose. Shit, are y'all ready to rock or what? Everybody know that's a jail pose when you with, when you with your homies. That that's the club picture jail pose. That's a fact, ain't it? Ain't it? All right then. He, he hit him with the. <laughs> he hit him with the. Either I'm going in or I just got out. Everyone got an uncle hit that pose. Fact. From the hood to college, both worlds, they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold, we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets. Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Dr. PGA GM. Praise God, your buddy back for another YouTube video. Hey, yes, sir. <laughs> Yes, ma'am. Y'all know what it is. The doctor's in the house. Kim was barking at uh, and some other dogs out there. Um, I was about to go to the front, but I'm glad I didn't. Um, but yeah, man. So, uh, I now let's go to the front. Don't you chase after that dog now. All right. So, uh, yeah, man. We, we, um, <laughs> so we, I saw, we saw, um, a good fight, you know, yesterday, man. We saw a big upset. But before we get to that, man, I want to talk about um, Emmanuel Navarrete, which was the main event versus Dennis Berichek. Shout out to Dennis Berichek, you know what I'm saying, holding down for Ukraine. Ukraine is doing good right now as far as the boxing world. You know, we saw uh, Vasily Machoko beat, beat uh, Kambosas. We saw Usyk win the uh, disputed heavyweight championship of the world against Fury. And then now Dennis Berichek, he beat um, Emmanuel Navarrete. Now I would say, if, if, as far as Emmanuel Navarrete, I like Emmanuel Navarrete, but he is who, who I thought he was. You know, he throws a lot of looping shots. Um, I feel like any type of elite fighter will, will give him trouble, especially one that has a uh, boxing skill and, and technique about him. Um, he, uh, Emmanuel Navarrete, I feel like he could have won that fight. Um, Dennis Berichek is an awkward style, but I was kind of disappointed because I didn't see Emmanuel Navarrete adapt at all, and I think that solidified that um, he's he's a, he's a good fighter. Is he though? But I'm I'm not sure if he's great. You know, um, I think he could have won that fight uh, uh, if he would have did like changed. A few things but he didn't change anything at all to try to adapt to Dennis Berichek's awkward style and he does have an awkward style so shout out to Dennis Berichek um, for winning you know what I'm saying um, congrats to him but let's get to the meat and potatoes because it was not the main event to me the best fight of the night was Brian Norman Jr. against Giovanni Santillan that was the upset again you know we had two upsets and um, <laughs> Brian Norman put that balls on the bro <laughs> I couldn't believe it, bro. And he was the underdog. I, I called this one, too. I should have put money on it, but I didn't. So it's crazy because I called a Jake Caballero winning against Frank Sanchez. I called Brian Norman B. Santillan, but I did put money on it. But guess who I put money on? Tyson Fury. And 
Joe made me so bad, but that's how that's how the cookie crumbles, man. You win some, you lose some. Oh, I also put a little bit of put a little penny on the menu and I've read that and I lost that one too, but it's all good, man. That's how a cookie crumbles sometimes, man. It's all fun. But um yeah, so Brian Norman, he definitely kicked made made the upset upset from Atlanta. And I'm bro, when I tell you he assassinated him, <laughs> Bro, I ain't gonna lie, man. It look like Giovanni said till he got shot. Right here. What's popping, Carmi? That joke was crazy, bro. I was looking around for a sniper in the building. Bro, that has to be a contender for knockout of the year. That was fantastic, man. Brian Norman, uh, he's definitely on my radar. Yeah, I already seen him fight before, you know, and um, but this really solidified it, man. Shout out to him. He was an underdog, and we love an underdog story. Brian Norman, hey, and some people might not like this celebration. I love it. Like I said, I don't mind you celebrating. My coach of football in high school always said, if you don't like somebody celebrating, don't try to fight them. Just stop them from getting inside the end zone. And that's what you got to do. If you don't want somebody to celebrate when they win, then don't let them win. You know, so hey, hey, these guys are elated. They put a lot of months hard work and dedication into training camp and when they get the victory hey man just like Kayla Plant bro, 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 that, bro I always like Kayla Plant but I definitely uh, uh when Kayla Plant uh, beat Anthony Durrell and he did the shovel I was like, oh yeah, this guy's the truth. This is my guy right here. So I, I love a good celebration, man. Shout out to Brian Norman. I look forward to see what he does in the future. And uh, yeah, that was a great fight, man. I definitely think that was a that that, that might be knockout of the year, man. Definitely for the a, a contender for sure. Y'all, let me know what y'all think about that. Do y'all think Brian Norman is a serious contender in the future? Um, I think he will be. And I look forward to look forward to watching the young man, man. Y'all be easy. God bless. Remember, with God, we can do anything. Without God, we are nothing. And the doctor's out. Peace. Man, I lost my voice. I'm sorry. We had a long 12-hour stream yesterday. We watched all the fights from um, from uh, the Ring of Fire, Tyson Fury, Usyk uh, card, all the way to the uh, uh, Navarrete to um, Navarrete and Berenche card. So it was, it was a long stream. Shout out to everybody that came through. Man, we had a lot of fun, man. Appreciate y'all. Catch you on the next one. From the hood to college, both worlds they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets.